Individuals with psoriasis may experience some severe physical discomfort and disability. Itching and pain can interfere with basic functions, such as self-care, walking, and sleep. Plagues on hands and feet prevent individuals from working at certain occupations, playing some sports, and caring for family members. The frequency of medical care is costly and can interfere with an employment or school schedule. People with moderate to severe psoriasis may feel self-conscious about their appearance and have a poor self-image that stems from the fear of public rejection and psychosexual concerns. Psychological distress can lead to significant depression and social isolation. Of people with psoriasis, 11 to 40 percent of people also develop arthritis, typically between the ages of 20 and 50. Called psoriatic arthritis, this condition causes joint stiffness in the morning along with inflammation and pain in the fingers and spine. Pink scales also appear on the knees, elbows, lower back, and chest. If this condition is left untreated, it can cause permanent damage to the joints. A recent study indicated that people with severe cases of psoriasis are more likely to develop other complications, including depression, obesity, cardiovascular disease, hypertension, diabetes, cancer, and immune-related conditions such as Crohn's disease. Getting rid of psoriasis involves much more than just applying some lotion or taking a pill. That's why doctors say there's no cure, meaning that they're unable to recommend a cream or a pill to cure the problem. But that doesn't mean there isn't a cure. Countless people have gotten rid of their psoriasis over the years by following the three proven steps required to address any psoriasis problem. Are you taking the required steps? Visit the 3 stepcurecom and follow the proven steps of others who have successfully dealt with their psoriasis.